Donnie, what's happening, man? Uh, nothing much, man. Y'all my idols. I, I mean, I love every uh, Sunday y'all play on television. Man. Uh, I'm completely blind, so if you see my background, uh, it's not my fault. I'm sorry. Uh, you all, all good, brother. We appreciate that, man. How you doing today? I'm doing pretty good, man. Pretty good. Um, big question for you. I went to a Black Lives Matter um, uh, event back at the beginning of June and videotaped the whole thing. Uh, mm -hmm. How has that, you know, changed your views uh, towards or, you know, stay consistent with your views towards the NFL and what you do and uh, all that jazz? Um, yeah, I would say um, it's just further uh, inspired us to continue uh, to try to do more uh, in our communities and other communities. Uh, people of color that look like uh, me and Deb. Um, I think back in 2016 when Cat first took a knee, I felt like he ignited a ton of guys throughout the league to uh, figure out ways to make change in your community, to do things uh, that are going to benefit those communities. And I think uh, he took a knee and everybody judged him for his knee. But it was what he did outside of the football field that I think was so important. The work that he continues to do uh, in communities to bring uh, not only awareness, but also to bring change. So I think uh, with everything that's gone on from the murder of George Floyd uh, to the protests uh, that have gone on, um, I think it's inspired us uh, when you think about the NFL to use that platform that we do have uh, to try to you know, bring awareness and try to continue to bring change, whether it's police reform, criminal justice reform, uh, education. There's so many avenues uh, that we can uh, create better opportunities and a better lifestyle uh, for black and brown people. Much respect. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, Donnie, that's dope, man. You out here not being limited by anything, jumping on a podcast, uh, going to protests, or I mean, uh, I know you're probably inspiring other people uh, just by being yourself, man. I just want to let you know that's awesome. My mom always told me when I was young, um, only thing is going to hinder you is you, you know, so everything they can do, you can do. Only thing you can't do that they can do is see. So show mm. them that it doesn't mean anything. Mm. So that's what I try to do. And it's like people like you and you guys on television is like my superheroes. I, if y'all can run 85 yards in like four seconds, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? I feel like I can do anything too. So I definitely appreciate everything you do what you do in the community for everybody. All right, well, we appreciate you, man. I'm sure uh, you may not know, but you're, you're a superhero to other people as well, man. Continue to just be you, man. That's dope. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate Can't you, wait to see that um, twin pick. All right, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right.